new journal and guide. Subscribe today. Ladies and gentlemen who are seated before you, uh, who are listed, some are not listed, so the, I'm going to ask each person to introduce himself or herself to you and uh, just a very brief description of your title or your uh, reason for being on this particular panel as you perceive it. I'm going to start right here with this young lady. Hi everyone, my name is Marquita Brown, I'm an NSU employee here in the School of Education um, under a grant called Teacher Prep. Um, I'm here to represent or be a voice for um, young women who didn't have a father coming up but still was able to be a positive influence or be a successful person. Good morning, I'm uh, Commander Marion Jacobs, I'm in the United States Navy, 23 years uh, of service thus far, and uh, I'm here to uh, to demonstrate or, or provide information and, and content to uh, the, the unique role that I have as a military member uh, to influence and, and, and instill um, a relationship uh, with my with my daughters uh, and, and their father. You know, it's, uh, it's a challenge being in the military and. Uh, and also a, a challenge as a, a leader in the military <laughs> uh, to, to make sure that uh, the roles of the, the husband and, and the wife are, are, are correct and uh, to, to nurture that relationship as um, my husband uh, being a father and, and the head of our household. Good morning, my name is Leon Sankofa and I'm with the uh, the National Call Day. We are in operations here in the Taiwan area in Virginia and Memphis, Tennessee. Um, my role here is really to kind of represent, uh, uh, I guess, the work and the impact of the, of, and the roles that the fathers have with their daughters. Hello, everyone. My name is Darnese. I'm NATO for State student. Um, I'm here to and also a military child. Uh, I did not have a father growing up, nor did I have that support from a mother. So I'm here to give uh, that aspect and show that I'm still going forward. I'm being very successful. Uh, good morning. I'm uh, Edward Fairley. I'm the author of the Handbook for Increasing Your Relationship IQ. Um, and I, I'm here as a father and someone who was raised without a father uh, and just someone that just uh, likes to speak on individuality and understanding people as a whole. Uh, good morning, my name is Renee Guidi. I'm a guidance counselor for the city of Chesapeake and a um, author of a new book, a children's book uh, called Our Daddy. It's about my relationship with my two daughters. Um, Lord bless me with two girls, I didn't get a boy, but um, dealing with those challenges and uh, the fun experiences I've had, you know, I'm having with them, so I wanted to share that with everybody. I think I have, you know, something to say in terms of dealing with, you know, daddy-daughter topics. So I'm a mentor to a lot of young men and women, and um, I hope I have something positive to share with everybody. Good afternoon, everyone. My name is Deshauna Brickhouse. I work for the CEO, Office of the President, Bank of America. I'm here to um, set the example or provide any type of. Um, answers to young women who have grew up without a father and who have had a stepfather and that you can still be successful with or without a father figure in your life. Hello everyone, my name is William Robinson. I'm a local football coach here in Norfolk, Virginia. I'm also a stepfather, this is my stepdaughter. Hoping out for any input I can give on how you can successfully be a part of your stepchildren's lives and still be a productive father and help these girls get the instructor that they need as far as they continue on with what they need to do in life. My name is Deborah Kiela Hosky, and I've done extensive research on father involvement and academic achievement in the completion of my master's degree here at Norfolk State University. Thank you. As you can see, we have a large and diverse panel. This production has been brought to you by Image Entertainment.